A police officer in New York State. <laughs> A police officer in New York State is being called the baby whisperer after he helped deliver his fifth baby in nine years. Only five babies in nine years, said Nick Cannon. <laughs> oh, okay, there you are. Okay. A 10-year-old boy in Florida faces misdemeanor battery charges after he allegedly touched a teacher's breast because under Florida law, students are required to wait for their teacher to make the first move. The Los Angeles Zoo announced that Evelyn, a 46-year-old gorilla famous for her red hair, has been euthanized. Not because she was sick, but because it's L.A. and she was in her 40s. <laughs> the World Health Organization is changing the name of monkeypox to mpox due to concerns that the original could be considered racist, which I didn't even really think was an issue, but now I'm just wondering, what's the N in N95? <laughs> After this year's elections, a record-setting 12 states will have female governors, <laughs> while, while the other 38 states will have dinner ready on time. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> France announced that it will start providing free condoms for people between the ages of 18 and 25. Cool. Now do deodorant. <laughs> Tomorrow is the New York City Marathon, or as Fox News will report it, undocumented Africans run wild in streets of New York. A white student at the University of Kentucky was arrested after she was caught on video using a racial slur and assaulting two black students. She has been charged with one count of impersonating a police officer. <laughs> I don't know if you guys saw it today, Morocco beat Portugal in the quarterfinals of the World Cup. It is, uh, yeah, it's the best World Cup performance by a team of Africans since the unpaid workers who built the stadiums. I didn't do it! In a speech yesterday, Herschel Walker called America the greatest country in the United States. <laughs> But on the plus side, at least he has a general idea of where he is. Brooklyn Nets star Kyrie Irving was suspended after he tweeted a link to the anti-Semitic film Hebrew to Negroes, Wake Up Black America. You know, Hebrew to Negroes was also the name of my favorite R&B group in the 90s. <laughs> this week marks the 40th anniversary of the classic Michael Jackson album, Thriller. And say what you will about Michael Jackson, but he definitely had a huge effect on a lot of people's childhoods. <laughs> I don't know what you guys like yeah. anymore. <laughs> the U.S. Air Force is denying that its pilots intentionally flew a flight path that created a giant penis pointed at Russia. Even worse, they then fired missiles. Wednesday was National Coffee with a Cop Day, and something tells me cops like their coffee with a couple of shots in it. <laughs> the chief, well, you're not going to like this. The chief, <laughs> the chief of the Cherokee Nation is calling on car maker Jeep to stop using the tribe's name on its vehicles. So Jeep has agreed to change the name to, wow, the Aunt Jemima Mobile. <laughs> A school in Virginia is returning a wallet to a woman 70 years after she lost it in a school gym. Well, how do you like that? Said a black man still in jail for stealing it. <laughs> a woman, oh, it's getting worse. <laughs> a woman flying to Detroit said she woke up to a pastor urinating on her, which explains why her dream was about her being baptized. <laughs> Fisher Price has launched an online museum showcasing its toys over the past 90 years. Or you can see them in person at America's most famous toy museum, the Neverland Ranch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
This week, there was a full moon known as the beaver moon, which can be seen about a month after a waxing moon. <laughs> That's a good joke. That's a good joke. Residents in Rome are upset after a wild boar and her six piglets were killed on a playground near the Vatican. But it's like they say, nothing good ever happens on a playground near the Vatican. <laughs> Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> One of Hugh Hefner's former girlfriends revealed that the Playboy Mansion is haunted. She knew it was haunted because if you turn on a black light, you see ectoplasm everywhere. <laughs> Officials in Colorado are searching for the man who was reportedly harassing a moose by chasing it down the street. Said the man, I like my girls thick. <laughs> A Brazilian man had to undergo emergency surgery after he got a four-pound dumbbell stuck in his anus. He then shoved it back up there and said, two. <laughs> anyway, that's why you always wipe down the equipment. An Arizona woman suffered more than 20 bee stings after a heavy wind blew a beehive onto her head. But tragically, no one filmed it. And Hostess is unveiling new flavors of their snack cakes, including white fudge ding-dongs. Coincidentally, white fudge ding-dongs is what they call weekend update in China. <laughs> A new study finds that frogs in the rainforest have a higher pitch call than urban frogs. The study also finds that female frogs be shopping. For the entire month of May, Applebee's is serving a margarita for one dollar called the Dollarita. After which you're guaranteed to come down with a case of Dollaria. A new study shows that people with a vegetarian diet may live longer. Okay, but for what? A popular new trend in Los Angeles are party goats, which are goats that are brought to parties and jump on people's backs. Uh, meanwhile, in China, a popular new trend is studying math and science. Domino's is reducing the number of chicken wings included in their meals, and I really wish I'd known that before I had my delivery guy fired for stealing. <laughs> to be fair to Judge Kavanaugh, it's insane that he has to answer questions about his high school yearbook. If you looked into anyone's high school yearbook, you'd find something super embarrassing. Like, I regret that my senior quote was a Smash Mouth lyric, <laughs> and I very much regret that my hairstyle was the Rachel. <laughs> Plan Planned, Parenthood. Planned Parenthood says it will soon open its first mobile abortion clinic in the country, which will make it easier to provide care to patients anywhere in the country that Herschel Walker has visited. <laughs> Police in Queens were searching for a suspect who hijacked a bus and then immediately crashed it into a utility pole. Okay, so we know it's a woman. <laughs> Bird? <laughs> Is that bad? Bird? No, that's no, great. Pebbles, who was the world's oldest living dog, has died at the age of 22. But it's okay, his owners knew this was coming if they didn't keep him off my yard. Ohio 
Ohio say that a report of a homeless man sleeping on a bench turned out to be a statue, which was a huge relief because they shot it 15 times. <laughs>